What's up guys? My name is Jason Morton and I'm an artist from Salisbury, Maryland. So this morning a good friend of mine dropped off this golf cart hood to get pinstriped. Let's get to it. All right, guys, before we get started, let me go over some of the some of the supplies that I'm gonna use for this project. Um, these are just my preference. Go out there, look at some other videos, watch them, find what's comfortable for you. Um, first off, this is the paint I use for all my pinstripe projects. Uh, the Alpha Enamel, Alpha 6 Corporation. Great paint, great coverage, dry time's amazing. Love this paint. I, I'll put a link at the end of the video. Um, you know, they're on Instagram, Facebook, the webpage. Google it. You'll find them. Definitely. Alpha enamel paint. Mineral spirits. I use the odorless mineral spirits. Um, again, this is my personal preference. What I use to thin the paint, clean the brushes. Tape. Measuring tapes. Measuring tapes. I, I, I use a lot of this as I'm going along with my Stabilo pencil to help keep my designs symmetrical on both sides. Um, of course, got my old magazine for palletting the paint on. This here is the Kafka grid. I use this on almost every project just to make sure things stay symmetrical. And, and along with that, I use baby powder and an old sock. Um, lay the grid on pounce it on when the uh, paint's dry it wipes right off no problem with the paint uh, brush wise uh, this one here i've tried loads and loads of different brushes this is the max king 13 brush absolutely love love this brush and for my small detail work i use these mac virus brushes Again, go out, grab a bunch of brushes. Just because it works for me doesn't mean it wouldn't work for you. Uh, find what's comfortable for you. Uh, lastly, uh, mall stick. I use a mall stick all the time. I've got a bunch of different ones. A lot of times they're made out of wooden dowels. And, uh, this one, I needed something that fit my box for traveling. So it's got a rubber ball at the end. I glued on. And this is actually an old selfie stick. Um, these help keep your hands out of the paint as you're painting or pen striping or doing lettering. Um, just really good, good tool to use. Um, that's about it. Uh, like I said, go out there, watch some more videos, find what's comfortable for you. This, this is just my preference of what I use and what's good for me. All right, let's get started on this project. Okay, so first thing I did was found the center line of the hood and with my Stabilo pencil, went in and made a couple just, just fine marks and then I went back with my Kafka grid and some baby powder and I lightly put in the grid marks. I, I do this on almost everything I do to keep things symmetrical. And once the paint design's done, it's real easy just to wipe off. All right, let's start the first color. All right, well, so we got the first color down. I never pre-plan my designs. I always use the same three starting points, which would be these, I like to call them snakes. And then another one down the center. And I like to build off of those. Um, I mean, and that's always up to whoever's painting, whatever you're more comfortable with. I personally, I just, I just love not overthinking it and building out of that center area and seeing where it goes. Uh, you can see there, there's supposed to be an emblem here somewhere. I'm not 100% sure where it goes. So I kind of stayed above that to keep things safe. 
All right, let's start the white. All right, I think I got this one all finished up. Um, let's take it outside and see how it came out. Hey, thanks for stopping in and checking out my first ever YouTube video. Um, really enjoyed doing this and looking forward to making some new episodes in the future. Um, like what you saw? Comment below. Give me some ideas on some, some, some uh, new episodes, uh, some new content. Um, what should Jason paint? Um, pen striping, inking, pencil art. I like to try it all. Love all different mediums. Um, hit the subscribe button. Maybe a thumbs up. Hopefully not a thumbs down, but either way is fine. Uh, ring that bell if you'd like to know when new episodes will be coming out. Um, right now I'm in the works of turning a lot of my original artwork into merchandise and that will be available soon as well. Check me out. I'm on Instagram. I'm on, uh, Facebook, you know, all the different social medias, uh, jasonwartonart.com. Thanks again for hanging out with me. See you next time. Hey, get out there and create something today and make the world beautiful. See ya.